Let us talk weather tonight, because by this time tomorrow night, maybe a little bit of a different picture on the radar. Scott Paget, what's coming? We do have a line of storms on the way, Doug. So, yes, by this time tomorrow night, you might hear some rumbles of thunder already moving in to parts of North Texas. Tonight, the cloud cover is in place. So, we've seen the moisture increase through the day, and you can see that we do have a lot of cloud cover over North Texas right now. We saw some spotty showers today. They've made their way well off to the east, and I do expect to see maybe a 10% chance overnight, increase to about a 20% chance in the early morning hours. Right now, overcast skies at DFW and 77 degrees. You notice that dew point coming now into the low 60s, so that means that moisture is continuing to increase. Our wind right now is out of the south at 15 miles per hour, but we've seen a breezy to windy day today, and we'll see that going into tonight. Right now, our temperature is sitting at 70 in Gainesville to 79 still at Love Field. We're at 75 in Stephenville to 72 in Bonham. So, looking at the wind speeds right now, remaining out of the south near about 15 to 20 miles per hour. So, off and on through the remainder of the night tonight, the future sky forecast. Shows for our winds gusting up to possibly 25 to near 30 miles per hour into the early morning hours, dying down just a bit, but still gusting up to near about 15 to 20 going into late tomorrow morning. So, this is all ahead of the cold front that's on the way. And those gusty winds and the warm temperatures just hang out in the air, all the allergens just hang out in the air and make it not fun as you're stepping outside or at least opening up the windows to enjoy some warmer temperatures. Today, medium high category, same story tomorrow, dropping on Wednesday because we have that cold front moving through, our wind switching around to the north. So tomorrow, I'm still going about 85 degrees, but notice your rain chances by 7 at 40%, and they go up even more into late tomorrow night. Now, we do have an enhanced risk of severe storms tomorrow for the majority of North Texas, but this isn't until the evening hours with the cold front approaching. So what can we expect with this? The biggest threat will be winds gusting up to near 70 miles per hour in this line of storms that comes together. Large hail also possible with these storms. Tornado threat, it's isolated, but lower. Uh, I'll keep my eyes on that in the flooding threat in the low category. So let's walk you through it. Tomorrow morning, some spotty showers around at a 20% chance, increasing a bit into the afternoon, 20, maybe 30% chance as we talked about. Here we are between 8 to 9. Notice that line starting to come together. So between 8 to 11, that line of strong to severe storms is moving into North Texas. Between 9 to then 10, 11, here comes that line even more. 11 to near midnight, pushing its way down to the south, breaking up just a bit. But still within that line, we have the potential of those winds gusting up to 70 miles per hour. And then to, um, on Wednesday morning, maybe some leftover rain. Temperatures will cool into the mid 70s on Wednesday, Thursday, lots of sunshine, 82 degrees. And then by the weekend, we'll be sweating just a bit more. We'll see highs into the low 90s by next Monday. Rain chances maybe 30 to 40 percent. That's a bit aggressive. High temperatures coming back down into the mid 80s. So not a bad idea just to keep weather aware tomorrow night as that line of storms moves through, Doug.